I was a drug addict. I had to admit it. I had to go get help. Um, it, it, and it, everything just kind of clicked to me like, you are on a path straight to hell, buddy. And now all of a sudden I've got this conflict in my head of like, no, nah, no, nah, and I'm fighting, fighting, fighting it in my head. And I, I feel total mental breakdown. And I'm choking my brother in the driveway. And I'm like, what is happening? And I remember looking up at this, the, the moon's glistening on me and <laughs> talk to him. And he goes, dude, your eyes were like cat eyes. They were not normal. Your pupils were going straight up and down. I'm like choking him, crying. I'm like, what is going on with me, man? I can't, I can't stop what's going on. And uh, he, he, we, somehow I got brought up to my mom's bedroom and she was praying the, the blood of Jesus over me and, and, and casting two demons that came out of me. I felt it. I didn't see it. I just felt like ah, convulsing. I'm rolling around on the ground, bloodshot eyes, all this stuff. I'm a psycho at this point, like legally insane, <laughs> legally insane, trying to kill myself too. And um, th- my brother says he sees them jump out of me as I'm convulsing and jump into the mirror. So now my, my, <laughs> my house is swept clean, kind of, sort of. I'm still trying to figure out what's going on. I know something's, cr- I could dude. I'll never forget this night. So it's just, it just is what it is. I'm calling for what happened to me. Uh, some people might say it's, so you science against it, man. This is a God thing. And um, I'm totally just freaking out though. And um, I'm trying to figure out. And I, I, I remember grabbing the Bible and like, I need to know what all of this means like right <laughs> now, all of it. Cause I'm freaking out. And I remember running over next door to my dad's house. I'm just like, read the Bible to me like right now. He's like, oh, you're out of your mind. Like what, what are you, he doesn't realize I'm on drugs. Soaking it up. <laughs> um, but I am just freaking out. They called the paramedics cause I was kind of trying to kill myself. I'm freaking out like, all right, God, I've got to go come to see you, man. Like, I don't know what's going on. And, I'm good and, after dealing with yeah, all that. Yeah, I'm out of my mind. Get me out of here. Totally, yeah, get me, yeah. <laughs> get me out of here. Exactly. I could feel the spiritual realm going. Now, I didn't have any hallucinations, like, as far as I didn't see what, because I've done, you think I would learn there, but I've done acid after that. And I've seen, it was not the same as that. Like, I kid you not, like, I've, this was not that. Um, but I, uh, the paramedic showed up. I got blood vessels popped in my eyes. Uh, and they're like, so let me get this straight. You're not trying to kill yourself. I'm like, no, no, why would I want to do that? Like, I'm like, like, so I, even though I'm out of my mind, I can still ration, like, bad, like, calm down, like, you are going to get Baker acted. Yeah. You know, I still had some sort of control, but, like, around, like, so I got to convince them to leave. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just trying to make, trying to make sense of all this stuff. I quit doing a lot of my stuff, and, and I tried to get plugged into the church. I did not understand any of it, though. And I did not explain this to anyone, though. I could, how are you going to explain that to a bunch of, a bunch of people? They're gonna, so at that yeah. time, I, I, I guess I got the fear of the Lord. It's the beginning of knowledge. That was the beginning of my knowledge. And I mean, I went, I went from being strung out on drugs to hearing some sermons to, okay. And all of a sudden I'm like, finally like, all right, let me, let me get checked into to a, a, a facility. Let me figure this out. It, um, and the only thing that really helped me was a sermon or, or some sort of uh, literally truth. Cause I'm like, I'm like, I'm, I'm hiding from everyone and I'm living a big lie. Yeah. And I don't want anyone to look me in the eyes. I want to be away from everyone. This isn't fun. And I just, whew. so to, to go from that to um, being clean, next month I will be one year entirely sober. <laughs>